Welcome back, my good little buddies. How you doing today? We are about to play some more... What's this game called? Horizon Zero Dawn! Um, obviously, my favorite game of all freaking time lately. Um, really excited to play this for you guys. Um, we're finally getting down into the deserty area. Which is... Like... I don't know, there's, there's like... F like three... Okay, what are you talking about? Yeah, why do they want me dead? When I catch him... He will talk. Oh, he will pay for we're gonna kill Olin. Oh, he's dead. He's done for. But basically, there's like three, um, at least three new dinosaur monster type people that we need to take down. Um, they're... They are more difficult, mostly because they have more health, not necessarily because they are more difficult. Uh, I know that's probably a, a weird thing to say, but that, that's what I believe. So, let's see. Look at that. It does half as much damage as my hardpoint arrows. And we get a skin out of him. Nice. That's what I like to hear, man. Good. Boom, boom. Four skin. Oh, no. A freaking Thunderbird. Oh, man. I do not want to fight a Thunderbird. Well, okay. Okay. Let's see what we got here, man. Some weapons. Ooh. So a Shadow Sling. So what we got, we just got the Shadow Tripcaster, and we just got the Shadow Sharpshot Bow. Alright, so what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to end up modifying it. I actually did that off screen, I'm sorry guys. I'm going to end up modifying it as soon as I get my, my Forge ability and I can tinker with these things. But for now, I'm just going to give it whatever I have. So let's see, what do we got? Uh, crafting, we're going to modify our weapon. Let's see, sharp, I don't really use that thing all that much. I think the, the main thing is our hunter bow, but I can't really change that much. Shadow trip caster. So, I really don't have that much. I could do a 40% fire coil, um, because it has some fire on it, but I don't know if I'm even going to use those all that much. I want the explosions to be the most powerful. Those are the things I use the most. So we're just going to actually, we're not going to do anything. I need more um, modifications, for sure. I need to kill some strong things before I do anything. And that's fine by me. It's fine by me, for sure. So hopefully they don't make us have to fight this Thunderbird already. I, I don't want to. I mean, I could run away. But that's not usually my style, man. If they if they bring on the heat, I will br I will bring on the heat. Let's so let me just stealth kill all these bad boys. Oh, yeah. Charger's getting stealth killed, man. Silent Strike. Charger. No problemo. Broadhead heart out of him. Nice. Uh-oh, he sees me. But I'm knocking armor off. Get an eye shot. That's okay. Oh, and we get a nice horn shot off of him. <gasps> but the Thunderbird sees me. No. 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 He aims me. Holy crap. Here's the Stormbird. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. Use those potions, Chris. This is going to get crazy. I can't even hit him from this far away. I wonder if I should just tear that that heart out real quick. Let's let's tear it out. Let's tear it, man. That was a bad shot. Tear it, tear it, tear it. No. Did I what did I get? Did I hit him? I think I got him. Boom. Tear it off, baby. Give her to that armor. Ooh, we got, we got a lot of it off, but he still hit me with some really solid stuff, man. So even from so far away. I want to hit him right in the chest, man. Right in the heart. Stormbird heart. That's what I need to get. So right now he's just chilling there. I'm cool with that. Just chill. Ooh, and we got a crit hit on him. All right, what I got to do is I got to try and... Um, get an explosion off on him. That's like 300 damage. Oh no, I don't think I landed one. I don't think that worked at all. Oh no, what the heck was that? Two, two potions real freaking quick. And now he's on the ground. Um, I don't know what to do while he's on the ground here, man. I might just have to roll like crazy. Oh crap, he caught me in some rocks. Oh, I'm in a cactus. I'm in a cactus farm. 
I think we might have blocked him off with the tree here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We can see his things. Oh, I didn't get to get him. No. So, fire arrows are pretty sweet because they obviously do some damage over here. But the main thing is I really want to hit those blaze canisters on the back of his... Oh, did I get it? I might have gotten it. Oh, we definitely got it! Oh, baby! That's what I'm talking about. Light him on fire. Light him up. Look at this damage right now. That is wonderful. Let's get some more hardpoint arrows over here. He's about at half health already. Still not doing an amazing job, but still doing something. I actually like being in these cactuses. It's really helping me right now, because he's not shooting me with anything. He can't shoot me with his electric bolts anymore. kind of just stuck. He's just like standing there. This is wonderful. So the tear arrows, man, that's how you got to take these guys down. Knock down um, all of their... Oh, here we go. We got another crit hit on him. But I can't get to him in time. His crits don't last very long. I'm just going to get a couple quick shots off, just knowing that I'm doing damage. It makes me happy if I can do 40 damage over a few seconds here. And he is on the ground here, so he's kind of stuck down here. If we get in these cactuses, we might be set. So he's going to try and blast me with some of his air, but... I don't even care about that. Come and get me, buddy. Come and get me! <laughs> oh, oh, it's hilarious. You can't do anything. Oh, 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 oh. But he can still fly. All right, so they didn't work out as well as I thought it would. But down to about quarter health at this point. That's not too shabby. Roll, baby, roll, baby, roll. I'm stuck in some cactuses. It can happen to me, too. Yeep. So he's going to start knocking these cactuses down, I think. Rebuild. Doesn't matter how hard you hit me, we can always rebuild. I don't even know what that is, but I need to aim it better. If we can knock off some of these um, random wing parts, we might be uh, in for some good... Oh, man, he blasted me. So we got to heal up with our... Uh, Whatever we got, man. Hopefully no other random guys are going to start coming at me, though. That would be really upsetting. <laughs> oh, can we get that? Nope, can't get the fire shot off. So he's got some, like, freeze things on him, too. But it doesn't even matter. I just need to keep doing regular damage to him. We already found... Uh, we che we're cheesing him right now. I don't mind cheesing these guys. Hopefully he doesn't just run away, though. That would be, like, the most cheater move ever. A few more to go. Boom. One more shot, and I think he's done. Ba boom Uh-oh. Come on. I thought it was one more shot. I'm already down to two shots. And there he goes. We took him down, baby. Whoop, 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 whoo! Talk about delicious. We get a Thunder, uh, Thunder Stormbird with three freaking... And, oh, some crystal braiding, man. That's exactly what we needed. This is wonderful. All right, so we got three resist weaves, which we're going to add to our thing right freaking now. We didn't go up a level for killing that guy, but let's see. Outfits. Let's modify this bad boy. Um, Modify some outfits. Boom, boom. So what do I need? Honestly, I don't like the freeze. We got... Ooh, this is actually a really good one, too. Extra corruption and freeze. I'll definitely take that. And then, um, with our second slot, corruption's kind of annoying. Ranged attacks are pretty annoying, too. Fire, I don't... Oh, man, those freaking... Yeah, we gotta do the fire for now. I can always move it and change it around later, but for now, that is pretty solid. I like it. So we're, we're uh, got 40 and 45% on fire and freezing. A little bit of corruption action, and not much electricity, though. You know, I, I feel like electricity is reasonably common, but not something that I, I'm worrying about in my uh, daily life. My daily life over here. So, what I'm going to do... Um... 
Where are we going right now? Shadow Sling. Return to the merchant. All right, let's go back here. Let's go get the uh, Shadow Sling real quick. We just got the Crystal Braiding. It was pretty much perfect timing. Now I'm going to have... Ooh, as long as I have the, the enough metal shards. I'm going to have to sell some stuff. But now I'll have every single one of the epic um, weapons already walking into this area, which is just absolutely wonderful, guys. Um, still not really enough modifications, but uh, definitely not bad. So weapons, bam, bam. Shadow Sling. Equip this guy on the bottom, and we got all the shadows. Wonderful. I felt like that was honestly pretty easy. <laughs> you know, it was pretty easy to get these shadow uh, shadow weapons. Completed an errand. It was my own errand that I set for myself. I was telling you guys that I, I did a couple things, and uh, I got all the epic uh, weapons except for that thing. So what I should do, though, is I should definitely save. So let's go over the fire really quick. It's not very far away. Um... There's a few guys over there I'm kind of afraid of. But realistically, I want to go to the fire before I do anything. I just killed a freaking Stormbird. And I don't want to lose my progress. I think you guys can understand, right? Please tell me you understand. Is that a rat? Oh, oh, oh where's the rat? No, oh, come on, where's the rat? There he is. Oh, it's a raccoon. It's not as cool as a rat. That'll keep my stomach quiet. The raccoons are pretty rare, too. You know, they're actually a little bit rarer than uh, foxes. Believe it or not. There's so much blue over there. What are these guys? We've got a long leg. Just all long legs. Broadheads. Broadheads. And a fox. Doesn't even want to tell me. What's that, though? A watcher. Hey. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Uh, should we go on a killing spree? I need, a, I need another 5,000 experience before I can go up to my next level here. Sadly, I don't think stealth works all that well in these guys. I think setting a couple traps is probably better. It doesn't make noise to set these traps, which is kind of ridiculous. Just set two traps, shoot them in the head or in the back or whatever, let them run towards you, and you win. How did he dodge that? What the heck? So what even happened to him? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there is definitely two of them. Holy crap. Oh, they're jumping over it. That's not very fair. Oh my god, we're getting destroyed right now by these long legs. Holy crap, with the two of them here. Like, one of them I can handle, but two of them? It's not really working out all that well. <laughs> I should really just finish one off. Oh no! Heal up, Chris! Heal up! You gotta survive! Oh my god, we're getting demolished! Okay, so we finished off one long legs, only worth 525 experience. That's like worthless right there. Hopefully this guy explodes and we kill him. There we go. He exploded, but he didn't even die from the explosion! Oh my goodness! And we got a heart from him, which is nice. But uh, at what cost, man? At what cost? Not not a good cost. Long leg lens. Gosh darn it. I think those are one of the things that I really don't want to fight very much. Long legs, glint hawks, bird types. You know, it, it actually brings back uh, a good point to me. I really hate, really hate, really, really, really hate birds. I don't like birds. I wish the birds didn't exist. Um, no, I think they're cool, but I also hate them. Like geese? Oh man, I can't handle geese. They are just annoying. They're really annoying. Alright, so I'm just walking over here. I just It just leads to more. It's like, oh, would you let us pick that up? Oh, this led to that. Oh, this led to that. Oh, this led to that. Oh my god, let's pick it all up. We're getting a lot of waxing waxes and stuff. So anyways, where am I going, guys? You know, we just killed the storm bird. Let's head on over here. Let's, um, let's, ex let's explore this place. How do we get there? Mm, we can't. All right, never mind. Let's go. Let's go to the hunting grounds. <laughs> that seems like a better thing to go for. That's that's also up top. It's also up high. Ooh, a fox. So I know that I can kill these guys if I use my hand attack, but I suck, and I usually don't make that happen very easily. So. Yeah. So here's the other new guys. Let's um let's check these guys out. This is a trampler. They're they're an interesting breed. 
Let's say that much. They really do trample you. Um, now, the first time I played through this, I definitely played on medium, and now we're playing on hard, so it's definitely going to be a little bit more difficult for us. Or we're playing on very hard, I think. Um, so, we'll have to see how it goes. See how trampolicious these guys are. But I'll boom. And we made it up. Okay. So, um, first of all, always save. Before you do anything, man, I like to save just in case I mess something up real bad. Um, I believe I actually have the rope caster already. Do I not? I don't have 200 metal shards. Let's sell something. Let's get rid of a broadhead heart. Just one. Get rid of this thing. And I can buy a quick rope caster. I'm pretty sure I need a rope caster for this. So just having this is going to be nice. Um, if I had to pick, honestly, I don't really think I use the shadow sling very much. So I guess we'll just get rid of that. Now we're low on metal shards, though, so it means more killing is necessary. All right, let's talk to this guy. Buy this. What do you do? This is a place I know I can. Excellent. You're well. No. All right, all right. What are the trials? Oh no, no, no. the trials. So and oh, I just want to start the trials, man. Let's do the, the pace trial. The remains of watchers rest on three rises. Loot all of them before time runs out. It sounds simple, but watch out for all. Oh God. Are you ready? <laughs> all right? We just gotta run around and get all the the remains. There's one. Two and three. Those are actually pretty reasonable to get. Alright, let's go for it. Oh, already getting hurt. Oh, this ain't good. Alright, so we're gonna try... We got the stealthy run right now, so that should help us out quite a bit. But, like I said, there's still machines all over the place, so maybe we can... Oh, he sees me. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Don't trample me. Please, little buddy. Don't trample me. He's about to light the ground on fire. <laughs> Oh, no, he's going to trample me. No, 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 jump. Jump, Aloy, jump. So, obviously, things are not going our way. And there's Glint Hogs up here, too, isn't there? Where are we going? Dude. All right. So there we go. We got one of them. We're going to go up here. There's another one that we got to take down. I'm not going to even... How, how long do we got? we got a minute and 30 seconds. We're already 54 seconds in. Dude, this is not going well at all. How do you get up? Oh, here we go. All right. Wait, what? Did the Glenhawks take him? Oh! <gasps> Okay, we gotta restart. We gotta restart. That sucks. Oh, talk about freaking annoying. Well, in the meantime, can temporarily take machines out of combat by tying them down with the rope caster. That could work. We could rope cast them if we want. But I don't think that's the way I want to do it. So I don't think I actually bought this rope caster yet. Oh, it technically counted. Okay. So, it saves us when we're about to start the trial. So, there's one there. Man, maybe this is one that's a little bit easier to get to. Let's try this. You have to get to it before the Glint Hawks do, though. Because if the Glint Hawks get to it, then um, it doesn't count anymore. We got a minute and 30 seconds. We got 30 seconds to get each one. I don't know where to jump up here. Oh, yeah, they're definitely attacking me. <laughs> All right, well, we got one. Oh, my God, we got her real bad. But we did it in less than 30 seconds. Oh, here we go. Here's another one in the middle of the map. So we made him angry. Oh, my goodness. I have no potions right now. So we got to use the, that thing. All right. That's fine. That's fine. No big deal. No big deal. Lots of deals happening right now. Joe, go, 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 go. Don't get frozen, Chris. Make this one angry. Make him stop doing it. Eep! Can we even jump up this thing? Ah! All right, come on, come on, come on. No way. Are you kidding me? 
Is there any way we can make him drop it? Wait, wait, wait. We can still make it. We can still make it. Come on, jump it, dude! Jump it, Aloy! Got it! Oh! Wait, that only- there's only two? No. I got it, though. I did all three! Did that one in the middle not count? Or did it, like... What? That is really upsetting. That is really gosh darn upsetting. I totally thought I did it right there. I grabbed it. But maybe it didn't have what I, I needed out of it. So I guess... I don't know if we have to kill the Glinthawks or what the deal is. Race Glinthawks to Watcher Corpses. Alright, this is not too bad. So there's another one over here, I guess. Problem is, I don't know where the heck to climb. It doesn't, it's not as clear cut as you might think it would be. So there we go, we got two. Um, I guess if this one counts, man, this is going to be an easy as cake uh, walkthrough right here. If it counts, that's the key words. Boom, three of three, and we did it in 53 seconds. Ugh. Where are they coming from? Oh, baby, we got destroyed. Okay, just run, just run, just run. I shouldn't be rolling. I should just be running. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, they're still landing hits on me. I need to turn stuff into potions for sure. Let's get some potion action up in here. Still got the Glint Hawks over here, too. They don't want... Are you kidding me? Alright, let's build some freaking potions. Craft some potions. Health potions. What do we need? I don't even have that much. Um... That's it. That's all I can get. I thought I had a lot, man. I've been killing lots of animals all day. Oakley doakley. Well, on that note, let's get going with uh, thing number two. In this Wrangling time, trial. You must tie down a trampler and shoot off the component under its belly. Good choice. <laughs> all right, so we got the rope caster, right? Um rope caster let's do it man I'm ready how many things do we have to knock off destroy two processors on a tied down trampler oakley doakley let's see if we can make this happen We gotta hit him with four ropes to knock him down, and then we gotta use one, hopefully, one tear arrow to knock it off. Oh, and they explode. Okay, well, that's good to know, I guess. There's the trampler, and he's trampling me. Tear arrow. Oh, are you kidding me? He wasn't tied down anymore? You gotta be joking with me, right? Well, that one died at least. That's good news, I suppose. Come on. There we go! Alright! We're alive! <laughs> jump! Jump, Aloy! Please get out of there! Alright, we made it happen. Um, I can't believe we actually did it to three of them, but they were lame about it, and it only counted as two of them. It's freaking Glint Hawks, man. You gotta be kidding me! 
talk to him. Just be done with it already. You wanna <gasps> the Gwen talks. All right, the tie down trial. Well, this this has to be even more difficult than the park well, wrangling the trial, huh? You can snare Glint -hawks. Glint Hawks. Lure them close to you, then tie them down in time to pass this test. All right. Are you ready? Holy crap, dude. Um, so I wonder if I can craft Ooh, my skills, man. So here we go. This is I don't, I don't care about that, but uh, I do want my tinker upgrade. So we got the tinker now. The tinker tank. Um, as far as this thing goes, I feel like I should have to go to a modify weapon thing just to just to talk to this thing. Uh, tear. It's actually kind of interesting, but I don't think that's going to help all that much. Um, in fact, that's what I should put on my shadow sharp shot bow, is just full on tear. You know, just a a add some tear onto my tear. That's really all I use this thing for. Everything else is just garbage. You know? So, let's do it. Let's add some tear on here. I'm going to add some more tear on here. Bam, bam. Now I can tinker, though. Ooh, I just realized. My Shadow Hunter bow, I can take this thing off. And now I can add on... Oh, I don't have anything better. I guess I can do 40% fire and 40% damage. That's probably the best thing I can do for now. Okay. Well, on that note, we're already down to um, our last little bit of uh, healing power here. Can't smoke it no more. But, oh, actually what I wanted to do, even in the meantime here, man, I wanted to craft some, some carry capacity for my rope caster. But I don't have any metal frickin' shards. Who would have thought that that would be the thing that I run out of? Alright. Alright, we're gonna have to sell some stuff to you, my friend. You can have a broadhead, a scrapper, a grazer, um, ancient necklace. You can have some. Uh, you can have this boar bone. Um, ooh, there's a lot of stuff here. A lot of metal vessels, too. A lot of chill waters. I don't use chill water for anything. Alright, that's good for me. Bam, bam. Now we're up to 859! It's wonderful! You can make money so easily. <laughs> Is that kind of ridiculous? We just go straight from 0 to 859. So now, when we go to crafting and carry capacity and a rope caster ammo pouch, bam, now we need fish bones and turkey bones. So we're already at, uh, at a hard point in our lives. We hit it. So, again, uh, I guess we'll save. Oh, finish the trial first. Okay, well, that all might be undone if we lose this trial. That sucks. We gotta tie down Glint Hawks. Huh. Alright. Well, let's see if we can tie down some Glint Hawks, man. Critical Strike, three Glint Hawks while tied down. Come on, get me a little Glint Hawk, buddy. That one doesn't want to fight. Dude, these guys are crazy. They're scanning for me. They're scanning for me. So yeah, they're all they're all angry down there. They're like, come on down, Aloy. So here he is. Here he is. Boom. Oh, it's too far away. Well, let me crit hit you, man. Critical hit. Boom, we get one, but that's that took me a full on minute to make that happen. Maybe we'll get lucky with this one. There we go. We got two shots on him. Oh no, there's a freaking thunder thing over here. Let me critical hit you, little buddy. Oh, what the heck? Oh, come on. That's stupid. 
Well, we're finally getting to the point where we're actually dying now. I guess this is sort of interesting. It's not in real battles. They're in hunting trial things. Ah, but it's still interesting to be uh, destroyed so elegantly by these monsters right here. So uh, I'm just going to keep it with 10. Okay, let's see. we got to shoot some of these guys. I gotta get him closer to me. Um, come on, come on over. This really shows off your aiming abilities, though, for sure, man. All right, critical strike. See, it takes a little while for the critical strike to actually like be allowed, which I think is pretty freaking stupid. I'm not gonna lie, I think it's pretty stupid. Now, oh, can we just tie this guy down right away? Come on. There we go. There we go. Crit strike him again. <laughs> oh! So we can just do this right back again. Oh, we just got annihilated. Ran out of ammo, but it doesn't even matter because we got one last crit strike in us, I think. But he's frozen too. Critical strike. Ba boom, ba boom. Completed trial. Doesn't even matter that we're almost dead and we're out of everything all at once. I literally have no more of that to use. Aloy, don't die on me now. We did it with eight seconds remaining as well, so that was pretty freaking intense. There's frozen stuff. Talk to him. Talk to him. Oh, and we have done it. But it did make it a lot easier that now that I realize I only have to fight one Glintog. I don't have to fight every single Glintog. It's seventeen thousand five hundred experience. What? The trial. All right, three out of three Blazing Suns, and we got a super thing. So there's another freaking Thunder Thunderhawk. There's two Thunderhawks. Oh. Oh. So we made it to level twenty-five. We actually skipped two levels right there. That is boss, baby. All right. So on that note, first of all, we got five skill upgrades to use. Uh, balance damp is kind of stupid. Um, if there's a, f what's the extra critical strike? Here we go. Crits deal more damage. I will take that. I mean, um, no, I don't really care about combat override. What do I need, man? Leader strike? That doesn't really matter either. Fast reload. I think this is probably the best thing next. I'm um, increase the maximum duration of concentration. So let's do this. We have that. It's still going to take another two levels to get to heavy lifter. And then eventually we're going to get to fast reload. Which is actually really, really nice. Um, you can concentrate and kill like two or three guys pretty easily. But in the meantime, where are we going to go? Well, obviously we're struggling a little bit. Um... I actually, my goal for the end of the video, by the way, it was to get here. <laughs> that was my goal. Um, where did we make it? We, we made it from here to here. That's it. That's all we made it. All right, let's get going. Let's let's do some fires. There's a metal. There's a metal flower along the way as well. So, um, I don't know how far I'm gonna make it, but I'm I'm rooting for myself, guys. I am absolutely rooting for myself. We want to go basically that way. Um, I'm gonna go a little bit around. We got a sandstorm over here as well, which is making things real, real interesting. I feel like these guys can see me through the sand, but I can't see them, which just is obviously and upsetting. These. Ooh, and one of these, and one of those, and one of these. Ooh, I'll take some of that. So, um, they're, they're like, they kind of know I'm here. Uh,. I don't know, maybe I should just kill that thing. No, I can't do it, guys. I can't do it. There's probably going to be a bunch of them that are going to come and get me. I don't want to die. <laughs> I don't want to die. Not again. But uh, we're following the trail. We're finally back on it, guys. 
Um, as you can tell, now that we're in the deserty areas, there's not as many plants, there's not as many things for us to pick up, there's not as much wood. So, uh, there are boars. What a boar this place is, though. Boars have skins. Oh, we're animal talismans, and we get to keep them. Um, I think this is uh, sort of sad, though, that we don't get very much um, health regen. I'm a little, I'll admit, I'm a little bit saddened by it. Uh, I think we're, we are going to find some. Good it's point. just, right now, it's very rare. We need to find some water or something like that. Like, here's the first river. Let's, ooh, a turkey. Let's, uh, let's pop down here because there's a lot of stuff we need, guys. We're down on everything. We just had some ridiculous fights. We thought a th we just fought a Thunderbird. We, got, uh, we did all those trials already. Um, today was a rough day. I'm still not even getting any of this stuff. I know that it's the red stuff, but I still can't, I can't even see with the dust storm happening. Ooh, a goose. <laughs> nice shot. Nice shot. Don't even get anything good from him, just some meat. So, of course, you guys know the drill. I head off in an opposite direction of where I'm supposed to be going all the time. Finding a bunch of random goofball-type stuff that I don't need when I'm looking for um, medicinal herbs. That's all I want. Give me my medicinal herbs, and I'll be happy. Any fish? Ooh. I actually do need my fish bones here, so... Oh, no fish bones. Meat's good, though. I don't know. Is it worth it to jump in? Probably not. Ooh, there's the metal flower, though. I found it. It's underneath the bridge. That's nice. They were so nice to us, making it kind of easy. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Alright, so what do we got over there? We got some broadheads. Yeah, we got some broadheads over there. And let's get going. So we're going to heal back up. You know, up to 450 health. Ooh, a rat. Tiny meat? I don't want no tiny meat. I want something good, man. I want something delicious. So the cool news is, is we are officially halfway through, experience-wise, through the game. Yeah, it's cool. Level 50 is the max level, just in case you guys are curious. Um. Ooh, here we go. There's a little mini town just to the northish up here. Boar. How how did that miss? Oh. Okay. It didn't miss. <gasps> I'm out of metal shards. Oh, again. I'm out of metal shards. Holy crap. Well, that really is not very good. I'm going to have to sell some stuff for sure. I never run out of metal shards like that. I thought I just had 800. What happened to them all? Maybe, oh, you know what? Maybe after I, oh, I remember now. I remember now. I didn't sell all the stuff that I actually sold uh, because I died. So, there's gooses and geeses and gloppin' and gloopsins. Alright, what do you got for me, buddy? Anything cool? No cool weapons? Any cool outfits? Ooh, they actually got something new here. Um, Osram Arrow Breaker Heavy. I don't really like it, though. I mean, it's... Like, 30% minus for arrows, but, like, I don't fight that people all that much. I'm f Ooh, here we go. Golden Fast Travel Pack. I need a fox skin, though. Poo. Alright, well, we'll sell, we'll sell some stuff. Let's get rid of... You know, I'm gonna get rid of a lot of these hearts, to be honest. I don't need... Let's keep the Shell Walker. I think I need that for something later. Um... Watcher Heart, Animal Talisman... We got uh, we got a bunch of fo boar bones. We don't need six boar bones. Process metal block. We got a bunch of random junk in here. Get a bunch of echo shells. But I should keep them. I don't need this many chill waters though. We can get rid of a bunch of these chill waters. I barely ever use chill water. And I think that's about it. I got a hundred and. I got a bunch of sparkers, too. We can sell these guys. Shock, wax, root. Don't use those things. Fire kiln root. I don't really use this much bony meat, either. Alright. We're gonna call it 
bam, we got 903 metal shards now. So now I can make my hard point arrows again. That's what I like to hear. So anyways, I don't think there's actually anything to do here. Um, but, give me some... something... Really? Is there really, like, nothing to do here? What was the point of this place? Just to have a merchant, I guess? So there's another metal flower kind of up here, but I'm not even going to go to it, guys. I'm going to still continue along this, um, this road right here. Continue along my way. Still got 1,100 meters to go. But now I feel a little bit better about myself. I've got my, nine, my 900, uh, metal shards now. I feel happy. We've taken down one of the strongest... Enemies in the game. Uh, was that? There we go. How did I almost skip that, man? That's something I need for sure. Nineteen percent health add to my medicine pouch. What else we got? Any raccoons need to be killed over here? Any rats? Anybody got some rat bones for me? I will take some rat bones any day of the week. All right, so let's see. Nine hundred meters. <laughs> oh, there he is, the Thunderjaw. I really don't think I can take him with my low amount of health right now, but I really want to try. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this fire over here, hopefully without him seeing me. Um, I'm going to try and fight him. And then if when I lose, I'm going to call it a day. <laughs> so I could just save and just restart whenever. But if we can knock off of his guns and use his own guns against him, um, things could go our way. It's possible. Unlikely, but possible. Uh, you'd be surprised. The nice thing about killing these guys is they give you some really delicious modifications. And uh, if we can get some, uh, you know, ultra rare damage modifications, put them on our bow, we're gonna be super duper happy, dude. So here we go. There's the fire that I was trying to get to. I kind of did a roundabout way on purpose, so I didn't have to fight the thunder job. But here we go. We're officially saved. Now, if I die, I really don't care all that much. Um, I'm going to. I'm gonna make this real interesting, guys. Build everything. I don't think I need any of that, but, ooh, give me some of this. What we do need, we need a lot of hard, po hard point arrows. Um, I'm going to see if I can pop down a few of these things. There we go, Explosions Mania. <laughs> Alright, we're doing a good job of hiding for right now. There he is, he's going ham on us. Alright, he is, oh my goodness, he's above us. How did he get up there, I have no idea. But, uh, he's above us right now. Let's run, 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 run. We need to get above him. We want to be on the high ground, guys. That's always the goal, get on the high ground. Alright, so we got this nice wall to deal with. Oh, he's getting kind of angry. So what we're going to do now is we're going to pop down um, our tear blast arrows. And with this thing, we're going to aim some of his main guns. So we're going to aim that gun. Ba boom Aim that thing. Ba boom Alright. Uh, and then we're just going to shoot him for a little while. Oh, you know, we gotta kill that main gun on top, though. That's for sure. That thing's gotta get tear blasted as well. <laughs> Man, oh, his heart's open. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get his heart, but uh, it's always good to, to think that you have the chance to do it. There it is. Component removed. We got some experience for it. 
Look at that damage on me, though. That was the one random little blue shot that got me. Oh, and he's getting better. Like I said, guys, keep the high ground. You're going to be happy with this high ground right here. So he's about halfway dead already. Look at that. <laughs> he is not happy with me. Can I get a heart shot off? Come on. Is that a heart shot? There we go. 200 damage right there, buddies. 200 damage. So I honestly don't remember if these are, um... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, God. I don't remember if these things explode. Let's check out the notebook real quick. Machine catalog. Thunderjaw. Um... Disc launcher. Freeze canister. Power cell. Radar. Cannon tail. So, we knocked off those cannons... But I don't know if we're going to be able to get down there to pick him up, guys. I think we're just going to have to fight him as he, as it lies. We can aim his tail, though. If we want. Does uh, slightly more damage. <laughs> Those laser beams, man. Those things are hardcore. Look how far he is away, though. Hope he doesn't just run away and get confused or something. Oh, he's coming back. Give me a heart shot. Ba boom! Oh, I thought I was gonna get a heart shot on him. Oh, out of ammo again. Uh oh, he's coming up here. He is not happy with us. Ooh, let's get some tank shots off. I don't know what those tanks even do. Let's get some tank shots off. It's worth extra damage. Oh, this guy's easy. They give it they gave us a lot of room to work with. If people are running up at this guy and like fighting him hand attack or something like that, like they're just idiots. Just hit him from afar. I'd like him to be a little closer, though. I mean, he's actually he's at the point where like I really cannot aim at all. I'm just lucky that I can hit us back pretty much anywhere and get 40 damage fairly consistently. 33 damage? What the heck is that for? All right. He's just about there, man. I think we like one more shot, and he's going to be dead. Oh, there's other people trying to help now. And there he is. So there's other people helping. Which is something that might seem like a good idea, but I hope they don't take the kill for themselves, man. No, it's my kill. My kill. Thunderjaw. So we got a corruption coil. Ranged attack weave. Resistance weave. Large machine core. Some crystal braiding again. Alright, I'll take it all, but I'm um, still... I, I wished I got some uh, damage, you know? Those are my main things. I like to get those damage coils. So that's a little bit upsetting. We might have to come back here. I might just kill another Thunderjaw later on. You know, definitely worth, um, definitely worth it for those uh, triple rare corruption coils. Anyways, we're 700 meters away. I think I'm gonna try and make it still, guys. I promised you at the beginning of this video that's what I wanted to do. Um, we barely got hurt there. We used a couple quick potions, and that was all it took. Um. I could ride some of these these random guys, but I, I or I don't know. No, I can't actually. I can't ride these guys, so I won't. Eep. I should probably save though. Where's that fire? I don't want to be caught with my pants down, having another thunder jaw come at me or something like that. That's just rough when that happens, guys. So there it is. So we found some more water. I guess that's good news. Um, sort of. Except the fact that there's a freaking wa- Who sees us? Ooh, some Ravagers running by. So Watcher right here. So we can indeed kill Watchers with one hit if we hit him in the eye still. 
For a little while, it seems like that wasn't happening. Oh, that's because there's the, the red-eyed watchers. Now I remember. Oh, it depends on the type of watcher. I wish the animation didn't take so gosh darn long. I mean, sure, I mean, it makes sense that, like, you want it to look cool and everything. But, it's just, like, too long for me. Oakley, Oakley. So we're kind of heading in the wrong direction right now, but we're going to take a ooh, another nice little campfire for us. So this is the nice thing about this as well, is that we can fast travel whenever we want to wherever we want, if we, des if we desired. So we got something up in here. What is that? I think that's a Ravager. Um, he can see us in bushes, but I still think we can sneak up on him. Yep, no problem, man. That's only 260 experience for killing this thing? That's pretty ridiculous. So how the heck are we supposed to get up there? I'm guessing we're not. I think we just gotta follow the, uh... The trail? What the heck? There's another Ravager right there. Um... Or Scrapper. Ravager, Scrapper. I mix them up all the time. Where am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to head straight that way, but they won't... I can't get up there. So, I will follow the only way that I know how, which is whatever way I can go. We're just gonna walk. Oh, you know what? That makes sense. Okay. So we messed it up. That's the problem. We were supposed to go a slightly different way. So we have to go all the way back that way, just so we can hook back around, man? Oh, that's lame. I think that's the only solution. Here we go. What do we got here? Bunny rabbit? Hmm. Turkey! Turkey. Fresh as it comes. I eat some turkey, man. I'm getting some tryptophan action, though, because I'm getting a little sleepy. Maybe my commentary can show it? I'm, I'm not sure. Anyways, um, I believe I was supposed to go this way somehow. There it is. Alright, now it all makes sense. All, like, one little tiny turn, and it made me, um, do everything all, all stupid. It was my fault. I'll admit it. I should have seen, I should have just followed directly where it said to go, instead of just kind of wandering, like, near the path. But uh, realistically, I don't even need to go all the way over there. We're just going to find the next fire, and we're going to save it out, and uh, that's going to be the end for today. But for tomorrow, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Boy, are we going to have some fun with you guys. Uh, basically, what I want to do is, after I get here, this is the nice new campfire town area. So there's a fire. That's perfect. Uh, I'm, I'm going to probably try and do some of the, the cooler things, like um, do the giraffes. Straight up giraffe that stuff, and then I want to do some, uh, uh, so much stuff to do. I just want to do everything. I wish I could do everything right now, um, but sadly, you, you can't, man. You just, you just can't. So, let's talk to these mofos. Anybody got a quest for me while we're here? Oh, they don't get to kill the buffalo. I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. All right, merchant man. What do you got for me, buddy? Shadow Blast Sling. Why is this thing 1,400 metal shards here, though? I got it for such a, a steal back there. Shadow... Bl oh. Oh. That's because it's a Blast Sling, not just the Shadow Sling. Well, that's good to know, I guess. Shadow Rattler. Ooh. I need a rabbit skin, a fox skin, a boar skin, and a bunch of metal shards for this, just this bad boy. Though, I never really liked the Rattler. I feel like it's you have to get up close and personal. I never like getting up close and personal. I'm back in the distance, shooting people from far away. So I don't really like the Rattler, but the Blast Sling. This could be something that I might want to use. 
personally, I, I think of the Shadow Sling as more versatile, but the uh, Blast Sling is definitely an interesting concept. Okay. I think we're pretty much where we want to be, guys. Um, Alright, so that's what I'm going to have you guys today. Um, obviously, in the next video, we're going to go into sort of the main story again. Uh, this is this is one of the quests that we've been trying to do for a really really long time. We've been getting distracted by Thunderbirds and Thunderjaws and everything. But but um, we finally made it. So let's continue with the main story for a little while. Still lots and lots of stuff to do though, guys. That's for sure. It's just because I kill every single animal that I come into contact with. I think that's the biggest problem for myself. But if you did enjoy, make sure you press that like button for me. Obviously appreciate that a bunch. Um, subscribe if you haven't, and of course, have a super duper delicious day.